General heard that some of you were experiencing some television interference from the transmitter at Chima Leon. So he decided to destroy it and the base around it, just to be sure. Well, you can't build a nation without breaking a base or two. Or kidnapping visiting foreign celebrities. Yes, all right, all right. Viva Medici! <laughs> Artifact. A promotion. Officially the youngest colonel in the army's history. I now work directly with Brigadier General De Luca. This ceremony, looking out over Cerilia, maintained proper modesty. The swift but quiet reassignment of De Luca's most loyal associates nears completion. Perhaps my own trusted soldiers might fill those gaps. Thank you. 
500. Armed with General DeLuca's authority, I decree that all forces in the Southern Islands must pay back the support of the local people by participating in infrastructure building during the extended peacetime. I ensure locals know my name at every opportunity as we pave their roads and build their bridges. Day 750. A picture of General DeLuca's car after his unfortunate hit and run received front page headlines today such a shame that this embarrassment happened on the exact same day as the ribbon cutting ceremony at Laguna del Sol. I humbly accepted the honor and give the speech in his absence. Looks like it could be valuable. Day 790, a magistrate put forth a vote in the local council to celebrate the Ravello Day. I, of course, declined while sending a message to Sergeant Major Dusko asking for his advice. In a tone of great gravity, he informed me that he would take the matter all the way to President Dante's office. <laughs> I can taste his ego salary at the idea of another rising of the ranks.
die in vain.